option on second down. Mott keeps it. Hurts down and more. Running away from Cowboy defenders. We're back at it, ladies and gentlemen, on NCAA Retro Bowl Mania, and we've got a great SEC battle for you as we've got the Aggies of Texas A&M taking on the Rebels of Ole Miss. A&M is on the road today at Oxford. Let's get straight to the action. A&M kicks off, which means Ole Miss has got the ball first, and they're moving down the field. Oh, but the drive gets stopped, and they miss the field goal, and A&M takes over just like that. And quarterback Carroll Hurd under center. Got first down. Oh, and a nine-yard pass and completion to Ali Skura, a.k.a. the problem. He's already getting after it. Oh, and a bad pass right there by Carroll Hurd. Not sure where that was going to. And second and ten. Ronald Shipley, the running back. Oh, and a nice tackle right there. He gets the first down, moves the stick, but he got blasted on that hit. And Hurd, a pass right there to Gilbert. Another nine-yard completion is short of the first down. And second down and one. And there's a pass right there to Skura, another 11-yard completion. And they're on the move already, just like that. And it's first and 10. Heard. Oh, Skura! He runs over a couple of uh, Ole Miss defenders right there for an 18-yard play. And they're in the red zone right now. And there's a pass up the middle right there to the, oh, the running back Shipley, as he thought he was going to go over the um, goal line right there, but great hit. But it's still first and goal. There's a pass, and a diving catch in the back of the end zone is Ali Skura, as we take, or take a look at the replay right there. What a catch as he laid out for it. And early lead right now, six to nothing. As a and m and as two more, goes right back to Skura right there, and it's 8 to nothing. Ole Miss has got the ball on the 27-yard line. They're moving. They're up to midfield. Running back is moving, and they're in the red zone. And at the end of the first quarter, they get on the board and tie up the game. And at the end of the first quarter, we're all tied up. Ole Miss, 8, and a and m 8. Adams got the ball coming out in the second quarter. Here's a pass right here. Oh, Gilbert, nice nifty move. And he dives and goes for about 24 yards right there. And it's first and 10. It's a pass. Wow, and I think he, oh, he did get his feet down. And it's a nine-yard completion, almost a uh, first down. It's a pass. Oh, my God. I was wondering what happened right there. It looks like it was tipped. But Gilbert was able to uh, come up with the catch right there for the first down. And Richie Edwards, a tight end, and they forgot about him as he looked like he was going to block and he released and goes for 20 right there. And it's first and goal. Here's a pass, and Gilbert shows his strength as he usually does. He kind of pushes off the defender right there. Could have been uh, offensive pass interference, but they let it go, and there is a touchdown, and a and is up. It's 14-8. And then Gilbert comes right back once again for the two-point conversion, and folks, a and is up 16-8. But Ole Miss, oh, and Ole Miss goes three and out right there. Which is going to leave the door open right there for A&M. Put some points on the board. 
Wow. And a little bit of a mix-up right there for the route as two receivers were in the same area. Shipley, two-yard run. He's been quiet so far. It's third and eight. There's a pass. And out of bounds right there, and they moved the chains. 114 left to go. Oh, what a catch right there by Richie Edwards. The tight end moves the sticks. And they're on a move right now. And Shipley. Oh, Shipley uh, rips off a 12-yarder. They're in their uh, hurry-up offense mode right there. And there's a catch right there by Skura, 11 yards. And another first down. They're right back in the uh, red zone. Shipley. Oh, Shipley! Oh, and once again, he gets denied. Going into the end zone right there as he had a pretty good run. But either way, Richie Edwards, the tight end, releases. Reminds you of Gronkowski in the uh, Super Bowl release and goes in for the touchdown. He calls an audible right here. And Hurd, he's going to uh, keep it himself. And her gets in for the two-point conversion. And it's 24 to 8. Let's see if Old Miss can score. And no, they didn't. They uh put one up, Hail Mary, and it was intercepted. So at the end of the first half, Texas AM 24, Old Miss 8. AM's got the ball coming out of the uh second half. Let's see what's gonna happen. And he airs it out. Oh, Gilbert! To 20! The 10, 5, and they're not going to uh, catch him, folks. And Gilbert, first play of the second half right there, right over the middle, 60 yards. The speedster, once he gets behind the defense, you're not catching him. And AM goes up just like that. It's 30 to 8, and they're going for a two-point conversion here. And Hurt keeps it himself. And he dives in, and it's a 32 to 8 game. And we're just starting to uh, start of the third quarter. This can go left pretty quickly if Old Miss doesn't uh, do anything. And right then and there, they don't as they turn the ball over again. And they're going right back to Richie. And Richie goes for 13 yards. And they're right back in Old Miss territory. Oh, and Shipley. And Shipley goes for 12 more. And I think they're going right back to him again. And he goes for 7 more. That ground attack. And I think they're going back to Richie. And oh, good thing. Uh, he broke off the route because that could have been intercepted right there. And let's see, 3rd and 3. They call an audible. Then they're going to the problem down below. No, they're not. But they go over to uh, Edwards, the tight end. It looks like he might end up having a, a career game here. Here's a pass. And it goes in to the running back, Ronald Shipley. Wow, it's hurt. I don't even know how he got that pass off. They had two defenders hanging on him, but somehow, some way, he did get it off. And there's a pass right there to Shipley, the running back. And this looks like that's the similar MO. You score a touchdown, then they're going right back to you for the two point conversion. Oh, Miss is moving at the mid um, midfield in the red zone. Passing play. But at the end of the third quarter, let's see what happens. I guess there was a commercial. They go for it on fourth down. Keep it on the ground, and they score. And they make it a 40-15 to 15 game. Ole Miss knew they had to run an onside kick because they are behind, but they ended up not getting it as Ole Miss recovers. Oh, man. And heard horrible uh, throw right there. Let's see. Oh, Looks like they had Skura open down the middle, but Hurd didn't uh, see him. 
in time, and he threw it away. Now we've got, let's see, third and ten. Uh-oh, but down below. And there's a pass once again by Gilbert. Looks like Gilbert's going to score second touchdown of the game. Or maybe that was the third, excuse me. But here's a pass right there, 45-yarder. Child's play. And there you have it. 46 to 15. They're going for a two point conversion. And the problem catches it. And right now it's 48 to 15. I think Ole Miss might be uh, waving a white flag. But no, they uh, tuck it right back in. And they score a touchdown. They said they're not going down without a fight. And it's 48 to 22. And they try to uh, the onside kick, but once again, it doesn't uh, work. First and 10. Hurt. Looking for the pass up the middle. Almost intercepted. We're going second down and uh, 10. They're going to Ronald Shipley. Shipley? Oh, it's Shipley! Shipley! And he goes 13 yards. It's like a battering ram right there once again. Broke three tackles. And he goes for another 13, and they call a timeout. Now I look to see what they've got right here. Skura, 101. But they give it in the middle. Gilbert! Oh, and Gilbert goes for 17. Call a timeout. I think they're looking uh one-on-one -on -one coverage. The problem right there, Skura. And Skura, touchdown. Let's take a look at the replay right here. And he fends off the defender. Touchdown. It's a 54 to 22 game. Excuse you me. This has been a beatdown. And they come right back to Skura. 56 to 22. It's a huge throw, but not huge enough. And folks, your a and Aggies are starting to just beat down the SEC teams, trying to figure out what do they have for them. Not much uh, at the moment as a and goes up 56-22. And let's see, tight end Edwards was on point today, like I mentioned. Looked like he was having a uh, career day. We'll take a look at the stats in a moment. And as we level up, Ali Skura, maximum speed, offensive coordinator, Virgie Ryan, one of the first uh, few women uh, coordinators in Retro Bowl Mania. She's doing a great job so far. And let's take a look at the stats. Carol Hurd, 27 of 33, seven touchdowns. Monster game right here. As we take a look, Ronald Shipley, eight rushes for 73 yards. Very efficient. Averaged almost 10 yards a carry. And also had two uh, receptions for 30 yards. Richie Edwards, another five receptions for 65 yards. And a touchdown. Ali Skuro. Relatively quiet game today. Eight catches for 74 yards, but did have two touchdowns. And oh boy, Clinton Gilbert, seven catches for 163 yards. Big time game. Big time. Farrell Connor, eight tackles. Lindsey, pretty disappointing right there. Zero tackles in the game. Earl Feeney, eight tackles. Zeiss. We've come to expect this from him. Absolutely nothing, unfortunately. And that's it. As you can see right here, we're going to go through and look. 56 to 22. 46 to 21. 54 to 46 against Georgia. High scoring game right there. But then we go 56 to 20 over Tennessee. And then 54 to 16. A&M is looking like a top uh, five team. Definitely looking to get into the college bowl playoff. So we're going to see what's going to happen next time, next week. 
Stay tuned. Gig them. Gig them Aggies. And we'll see you next week on Retro Bowl Mania.